The Wellbeing of Future Generations Act is unique to Wales. It sets out a vision to make Wales the country we all want it to be. Wellbeing is no stranger to us in the third sector. But this Act now legally requires 44 public bodies in Wales to work towards seven wellbeing goals. These aim to improve all aspects of our well-being, not just for now, but for future generations too. We can also work towards these goals to help create the Wales we want. A prosperous Wales means an end to poverty, a decent education and training and jobs for everyone. This also requires a modern, low-carbon economy that doesn't use natural resources faster than they can be replenished. So for your project, this could mean helping volunteers or staff improve their skills, or becoming a living wage employer, or supporting other local companies or enterprises near to you. You can be part of the low-carbon economy too, by monitoring and reducing what you use, and making sure your premises are as energy efficient as possible. A resilient Wales means maintaining and enhancing a healthy natural environment so that future generations will also be able to enjoy nature, breathe clean air, eat nutritious food and have the energy and resources that are essential to our economy. So you could consider how your organisation can support the natural environment as well as reducing the demands you place upon it by choosing environmentally friendly products, switching to a renewable energy supplier and doing your bit to make space for nature. A healthier Wales means a society where people enjoy better health for longer and understand how their lifestyles today can affect their health tomorrow. Health isn't just something to think about at home. We can boost well-being at work too by demonstrating a good work-life balance and helping staff recognize and deal with stress. Providing healthy food at events and encouraging people to walk or cycle can also help physical and mental health. And it sends out the right messages too. A more equal Wales means everyone has the chance to fulfil their potential, regardless of their background or circumstances. The third sector has led the way in highlighting inequality and campaigning for change. We can carry on this work by actively monitoring our own activities and working to remove any barriers that might prevent people from joining in with them. We can also continue to challenge discrimination and stand up for human rights. A Wales of cohesive communities means a Wales where people live happily together and feel that they have a stake in their community, which also provides access to decent housing, transport, public services and jobs. As a third sector organisation, the chances are that you are already helping to strengthen relationships in your community. Sharing your knowledge and experience with the public bodies in your area could result in better local services and more people feeling that their voice is being heard. A Wales of vibrant culture and thriving Welsh language is the Wales that we love. The Wales where sports, arts, culture and the Welsh language can be enjoyed as part of everyday life by everyone. The third sector already plays a huge role in supporting arts, sports and recreation. Maybe your organisation can promote or enjoy these things even more, whether it's reinvigorating your Welsh language policy, enjoying more of our natural or historic heritage, or simply inviting those around you to share their cultures. Achieving this goal should be fun for everyone. A globally responsible Wales is a Wales where we only use our fair share of resources so that we don't worsen global challenges like climate change and poverty and we act in a way that avoids the exploitation of others. This sounds like a massive goal for a third sector organisation but there are little changes that can add up to a big impact such as creating an ethical investment or purchasing policy, choosing to buy fair trade, reducing your greenhouse gas emissions and supporting campaigns that challenge global inequalities. So that's it. The seven goals of the Wellbeing of Future Generations Act. As the third sector, we're already helping Wales towards each one of these goals and we can support public bodies and each other to go further. 
If we really set our minds to considering each of these goals before we make any decisions, then we can bring the whales that we all want closer, the whales that we deserve. <laughs>